here's my first question for you. Okay. What's the weirdest um, bad smell you like? <laughs> weirdest bad smell. You know what? Uh, Can I set this up no, first? No, it's true. Okay. We were talking about weird smells before we started rolling. I don't know what she's talking about. This is a random question. Yeah, it's just random. Uh, I just made it up. A, a weird smell that I like. You know what? Sometimes if you're going through New York and like there's like there's like a sewer smell, but like oh, but there's I something you, you know what, you know what smell I'm talking about? Oh, I know. But what you're there's talking like about. it's almost mixed smells, with a little with like vanilla. It's like vanilla <laughs> garbage pretzel, and for some reason I don't know about the vanilla part. I don't know where you got that. Maybe, I think some girl walked by. Maybe it's like, I don't know. It just always said I smell a hint of vanilla in there. Uh, you know, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, and Good answer. I've, uh, they, I always enjoy that smell. It's like I walk around. I'm like, smell. I'm in New York right now. Yeah. Wow. Oh, it's distinct. The subway. Wow. Yeah, I'm like yeah. it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 You don't take the subway in New York, do you? I don't know. Sometimes. You have Vampire Diaries and all that. You get car services. Uh, and, you know. Right. Yeah. Well, maybe not anymore. Oh, yeah. What are you going to do? You yeah. got to go back to here, the here's a, here's, a, here's a little vinegar for the wound, <laughs> huh? Sure. Okay, so now that we have the um, we have Wilson. This is I Wilson. I know you've done a great Two point um, Arnold Schwarzenegger Arnold impression before. Arnold. Arnold. Put the cookie down. There you go. He's I'm, not a tumor. Just keep going. Oh, yeah, sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, go. Okay. Uh, what do you want me to say? Um, I want a little Tom Hanks, a little... Uh, Castaway. Wilson! <laughs> that's that's, a, that's you know, actually really know. good. Oh, thank you. All right, so let's talk about All right. get ready for the tears, people, because <sighs> you're exiting. There you go, the angst. The angst. Bring it. You're exiting Vampire Diaries. Damn. Look who graduated. <laughs> hey, he was okay with it? Sure. I mean, practically. Flunking, missed 100 days of school, and you can barely spell the word cat. But sure, he was fine with you graduating early. We helped the process along. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna get a drink. She okay? She will be. We all will. Somehow we'll all find a way to move on without you, Jeremy. Oh, hey. Just did. Oh, look under the cap. I jacked a little going away present from Rick's girlfriend's stash. Put it away, you idiot. Just watching the promo. Okay. I'm sad. Like, I'm sad to see, because he's such an endearing person, and he's yeah. become so endearing to people. Yeah. Just the last moment, because I know they always um, say, it's a wrap for Steven. You know, they yeah. always do that. And when you do a guest star on a show and it's one day, you're like, yeah. oh my gosh, this has been great. I yeah. can't imagine all those seasons later. Yeah, six years. I, you know, I started the show when I was, I was, uh, I was, I think 20, 19 when we shot the pilot and then 20 when we actually started. And, uh, you know, the last day uh, was weird. You know, it was one of those those moments where you kind of like had a countdown clock going, but you're like, oh, you know, whatever, I'm hanging fine. out with everyone, everyone's laughing, you know, Malarkey just farted, you know, we're laughing about it. <laughs> and then there was the last scene, um, which I, I can't really say what happens. Uh, of course you but, can't. But, sure you uh, can. Why not? Well, you know. I mean, you've already left the show anyway. What yeah, can they do? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> hey. Uh, well, anyways, there's a scene where like I'm on the ground. And they kept on saying, like, all right, let's do it again, let's do it again. And, like, we did it about ten times, so I was like, hey, uh, Chris Grismer was our director of that episode. And I was like, Grismer, what's, we, what's going on here? He's like, all right, one more time. They tilt the camera up and, and face it towards the door. And, uh, and literally the entire cast, the entire crew comes running out in superhero costumes. I heard about With this. a big old cake and, ah. like, grabs my face and shows my, the cake in my face. And, I and just they got it like, on camera? Yeah, and it's just one of those moments where it's like everything was coming to an end, but these people I grew up with, you know, I learned to not be such a such a, a dumb kid. Well, I guess I'm still a dumb kid. I play video games, but, uh, I, you know, it's, 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 it's just... 80-inch TVs, <laughs> by the way. Inch, I was but, you know, 65. You'll I'll get there one day. I'll get there. You'll get there. One day, there. One day yeah. you know. Um, and uh, I don't know. It's just one of those moments where it was, it was family saying goodbye, like sending me off, and it was... Uh, it was incredible. They shot the entire thing. There's footage of it, and uh, it, was, it was really special. I wanted to ask you um, about the whole UFC thing that you're into. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you Anderson do a Silva lot of just you, fought again. Yeah. You what? No, I do. I do train. You do train. No, I do. You do train. I wanted to know if there was anything you could teach, you? teach me. Uh, well, I mean, what, what do you want to learn? 
how to kick some butt, how to kick some serious behinds. Okay. Um, like, like, I want to know what to do if some creepola comes up to me in a bar and I want to just drop him. You want just kick him in the nuts. That's what, that's what <laughs> I recommend. He'll drop real quick. I want you to give out some awards, okay, okay to your castmates as right. you're Let's departing. Start. All right. Who is the best crier on cue? Uh, and you like, can name yourself. No, feel I feel free. like Cat Graham. Cat okay. Graham usually like we'll do take after take, and like a lot of the time you'll see like people when it's on someone else's coverage, they'll kind of hold back. But Cat, whether it's your coverage, whether it's her coverage, she consistently brings it there emotionally, and and uh, she's consummate professional. Season one. Season one. Season one. Um, it's my boo. Who do you think does the best vampire face? Wait, let me see what's like a vampire face. Oh, know. you know Joseph uh, well, Morgan was here and we did the whole thing and they CGI'd uh, this situation. First open your mouth really wide. You have to imagine you have the fangs there and then just like kind of squint up your eyes and think furious. And, so and I can do a vampire and a werewolf and I'm a really more attractive vampire than a werewolf. Okay. But well, I will only do it if you do it too. Well, I don't know how to do it, so you have to show me. If you insist. Um, okay, vampire is... Is that, that doesn't seem like a vampire. I didn't really commit to it. That was, if that really, was like Count Chocula. I'm still trying to be semi-attractive, okay? That, that, that was Count Chocula And then at most. Werewolf, I'm really going to go there. So, okay. Like, so awful. So, like, vampires, like, like... Uh, it's the overbite, underbite. Okay. Uh, okay. And do you have, looking back, one moment you're most proud of? I, I'm proud of, like, the friendships that I made last last six years. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for having Come me. Come back. I would love to. Um, when you're super